All right, what's up? A Pure TCG here back with an undefeated local deck profile. What's your name? What'd you do? My name's Ryan. I won locals this week playing TG. TG 4 Oh, let's go ahead and get to the deck profile. All right. So 41 card main deck, uh, three rocket salamanders is the best card in the deck. Um, they just printed broken cards for TGs um, in a couple sets ago. Um, three gear zombies. Gear zombie plus salamander is um, calamity lock. So you play as many as you can. I play two serpents. I see a lot of people run three. It feels really bad to draw. So two gives you um, the ability to still combo if you draw one on accident but you're, you're not drawing it all the time. Uh, one tank grub for the combo, one drillfish. Drillfish won me a lot of games today. You summon it, you attack direct, you, directly, you pop a big card your opponent controls, um, and you, you out nib tokens, anything like that. So that's all the TGs. We play the Diabell Star package. I play two witch um, because I don't have a third, but also it's, uh, it feels good at two. I don't ever feel like I'm not seeing it enough. Um, then we play a bunch of hand traps. We play triple ash. Triple Droll, Double Nib, Beck Valor. Um, they're cross out targets and they also, um, you know, you want to play a bunch of hand traps right now and stuff people. Um, we run three limiter removal. This card is one card full combo. You search a Salamander and a Gear Zombie and you have Calamity Lock. So three of those. Uh, two TG All Clear. It's part of the combo. It's another card that you don't want to see all the time because it's searchable in the combo. But it is helpful when you see it in the main hand if you have another TG. It gives you an additional normal summon. It pops a card to search a TG monster. So And it turns all of your TG synchros into machines, which is very important for TG Close, the counter trap that they gave the deck. Um, I play one one for one. You can find the Salamander. If you already have the Salamander, you find the Gear Zombie. So it, it, it enables combo. Triple one for the Diabell Star package and the the one Snake Eye. Snake Eye also searches Salamander. This deck is just get to Salamander. Basically. So now that we got to the full Diabell Star package, do yeah. you really think the second witch is necessary or? I like it. Um, it's I I I never see it in the hand. Like I never draw it and go, man, I wish this wasn't in the hand because it still gets you. Even though you don't get the additional draw if you don't start with the wanted, um, it still gets you to Rocket Salamander, and that's okay. that's all you want to do is get to Rocket Salamander. Um, I run one thrust, um, one talents, just uh, you know recover if I need to or stop my opponent. The the combo is fragile, so if you get stopped on the combo, you're you're doing everything you can just to get to turn three. You're probably not going to set up a crazy board. I did a couple times today; it was kind of fun, but. Um, the thrust just puts you on turn three if you need it. Uh, same thing for the, the cross outs and the called by, you're just trying to protect yourself as much as possible. I also run double imperm. The karma cannon is the primary search off of thrust if I get, if I get stopped on my turn. Um, karma cannon, a lot of people don't play around it, especially game one. So this got me to, game, to turn three a lot today. And then finally I run the TG close. TG close is searchable in the combo. If you have a synchro machine monster, um, you can just negate a card activation, which is really strong. If you have the TG or the Calamity Lock set up, uh, you let your opponent play one card in main phase with priority, you negate it on uh, counter trap speed, and then you and then you make Calamity. So it makes everything but Super Poly um, can't out it. So it feels really good. Um, that's the main deck. We'll go to the extra next. Um, combo pieces, TG Mighty Striker I play two of. Search a TG spell card that's normally all clear. Or, and when it's sent to graveyard, you can send any TG card to the graveyard. TG close when it's in the graveyard, you banish a TG synchro, or when you banish a synchro monster, this sets itself. So, very strong card. I play one Star Guardian. It's again part of the combo. It'll add cards back to your hand. It also quick synchros on your opponent's turn. So if you don't have full combo, you can put this in a five on the field and make up a Roan just to kind of get you past. Um, the best card in the deck is TG over Dragon Art. This is a soul charge. Special summon as many TGs from your graveyard as you want. Um, so it makes anything possible. Uh, Actually insane. It is, it is a broken card. We play the Hyper Librarian. If you're, if you're going through your primary combo, you're drawing at least three cards off of this, which, you know, um, my last round today, I drew a Droll off my last draw and then drolled Dark World, and it uh, feels good. Um, in, the, in the big ones, we play a Barone for the Star Guardian line. We play TG Blade Blaster as part of the main combo line. This card can banish the, um, the Mighty Striker. So you can banish the Mighty Striker in your opponent's draw phase with this. This goes away. You use Glade Blaster to bring back the Mighty Striker, and you can make Crimson Drain. 
Um, speaking of Crimson Dragon, there it is. That's what gets you the Calamity. This card or Calamity needs to be banned. Calamity will probably be the one that gets banned. Um, we play two of the Glade Blasters. This card can target and banish a card summoned from the extra deck up to the number of t uh, times that, or up to the number of non-tuner synchros you use to make it, which is two most of the time. Two targeted negations is, feels really good in most situations. You can also special summon a card that is banished face up once per turn, uh, ignoring summoning conditions. Um, we play a Halberd Cannon for the Crackback. This card dominates King Sark. Uh, you can make it. If your opponent's trying to go into like a big rank eight, you negate the summon. Um, when you swing into a Horus card, if the King Sark is still on the field, they pop this. You special summon Blade Blaster or another TG from your graveyard, and you can play the game. All right. And, oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, I got to get going here. So <laughs> okay. if we can run through the last yep. two. Last two, Calamity, teach, Trident Launcher. Um, Calamity for finishing the combo. Trident Launcher for fixing combos if you've been stuck. So. Insane, you'll see that in the tier matchup. Let's run through the side deck right. just real swiftly. Real, real fast, we play Board Breakers, so the Tributes. We play um, back row, removal. We play one Herald of the Abyss if you're going into a Towers matchup. You play double evenly. A D barrier to search off thrust. That won me a game today. And then two anti spell because we're no fun. <laughs> nice. Thank you so much for the deck profile. Good, good luck going forward and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.